Hey guys, it is Arika Misha and today we are cooking curry chicken, yellow rice, and we have some plantains on the side. So let me show you guys what I will be using today. Um, I did pick up the Publix plantanos, just pretty much plantains. And um, I always grab these when, I, um, when I'm craving plantains. And these cost like, a, like $2 at Publix. I mean, very inexpensive and it's a good amount in this box. Just a little, little small, medium box of plantains. It's the Publix brand and it's good. That's all that matters. All right, and I got my beef broth. I know I'm cooking chicken, but I only have beef broth. You can use beef chicken, whatever. So I have beef broth, so I'm using the beef broth. You guys will see what I use that for. And of course you guys know I love the Vigo yellow rice. Vigo. Vigo yellow rice. And of course, the curry chicken. And today for the curry chicken, I'm using like the small wings, like the drums and the drumettes. The drums and the flats. And you guys see I've been having it. It's been marinating overnight. And you guys see how that curry chicken looks so good. When I cook curry chicken, I love to let it sit overnight. So that curry can soak all the way through the chicken. So yep, that's what we're doing today guys. Curry chicken, yellow rice, and plantains on the side. Let's get to cooking. All right guys, the first thing I wanna do is go ahead and get my chicken on. Uh, and I am gonna be cooking the chicken, uh, my curry chicken in my Instapot. So as you can see, I've got my Instapot all plugged up. It is waiting for instructions. All right, and this is easy. Nothing special. Um, like I said, you can use chicken broth, beef broth, whatever broth you want to use. Tomato, tomato, potato, potato, whatever. But um, like I said, today I'm going to be using the beef broth and I'm going to put two cups of beef broth in my Instapot. Two cups. And I've got my little measuring cup here. It's half a cup. Put that in, half a cup, half and half makes one cup, and we're putting two cups of this, guys. So we've got one cup in there, that's our half, and our last half a cup. All right, so that's two cups of our beef broth. We move the beef broth out of the way. Okay, now remember our chicken has been marinating overnight. So it's all nicely seasoned. We don't have to season that broth. Our chicken is fully seasoned. So only thing I'm gonna do is just drop my pieces of chicken in. Y'all gonna have to wait. Let me see if I can get you guys in that Instapot. I was gonna use my handheld, but just kind of wiggles, I kind of wiggle all over the place with that thing. If I'm doing something simple, I usually get my hand held, but. So I'm laying my pieces of chicken down in the juice, down in my broth. Just gonna stack these in there. And like I said, your curry's already, your chicken's already seasoned, so you ain't gotta season that broth. And the broth already has its own flavor as well. I'm just gonna layer this chicken in here in my Instapot. And I will show you guys in a minute. And that's my stove preheating. I am going to throw, I am going to throw the plantains in the oven. I'll let you guys see me do that. And this is a nice, nice, simple meal. Everybody loves curry. Well, not everybody. Curry chicken yellow rice and some plantains on the side this can be whatever you want it to be for a Sunday through the week dinner whatever whatever you want it to be now my little seasons that's left in my bowl I am gonna put a little water in my bowl just a little bit of water let me wash my hands off I am going to put a little water in my bowl, swish it around so I can get all those seasons that's in there. See, 
how I put the water in there. Can't really show it because it'll waste out, but you guys can see. And now I'm gonna go ahead and pour it in my pot. Cause I'm not wasting my seasons. Y'all know me, I'm gonna get all my stuff. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead, put my lid on. My lid on my Instapot. All right, so I've got my lid on. And of course, my pressure cooker top is open. Is I'm sorry, closed, duh. Close it up, make sure it's closed. Let me check. I'm gonna make sure it is closed. Let me see. Yep, it is closed. Make sure it's locked. It is locked. Okay, I'm closing it. Yeah, you gotta be careful with the Instapot. Know what you're doing when it comes to these uh, pressure cookers. So, <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put it on for 30 minutes. 30 minutes. So, of course, your Instapot, I'm setting it for 30 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and cook the chicken for 30 minutes. It's a little skinny drumlets, drumlets and uh, the flats, so it shouldn't take long. Um, I've got it set for 30 minutes on my Instapot. So I'm gonna go ahead and let that cook. And of course, I'll be back to let you guys see um, what it looks like after it cooks for 30 minutes. That's all it should take, 30 minutes. All right, so we've got our chicken in the Instapot. Let's go ahead and get these plantains trayed up to go in the oven, because the oven is ready for those. And let's get the yellow rice set up. All right, give me a second, I'll be back guys. Okay, let's get our plantains ready to go in the oven. Um, I've got the oven preheated at 350 degrees and I'll put these in for about 20 minutes. They're frozen and of course they'll cook while our chicken is in the Instapot cooking. So everything will be cooking together and everything will get done together. Same thing as our rice. As soon as I get these plantains in the oven, um, I will go ahead and get the rice uh, on the oven because that takes like 20 minutes too. And you can see the plantains, Publix, these are the Publix brand. Let me show you guys again. Publix brand, Plantanos. Plantanos. Yeah, I'm fluent in Spanish too. No, no, not really, but anyway. Yep. And let me show you guys the plantains again. They're frozen, but they're easy too. I get these all the time. They're easy to separate. Get these cut open. Come on, scissors. All right, so. And they're easy to peel apart. See, as you see, I just take them apart. Oh, and I forgot, give me one second. Gotta spray my pan. Of course you guys know I've got my pan lined with aluminum foil to make it less messy, less of a cleanup, and also wear and tear on your pans. Cover them with aluminum foil that helps preserve your pans so they don't get all scratched up and burnt up and they look all burnt and old, you know? Helps preserve your pots and your, well, your pans when you're cooking and baking and all that good stuff. So I'm just gonna lay these plantains in here. And like I said, these are the Publix brands, but they are really, really good. They are really good. Wash my hands real quick. Yeah, this is the Publix brand, but I get it all the time. Um, sometimes I get the uh, Chiquita brand. They have the big bags on sale at Publix. Buy one, get one. I'll get those when they are on sale. But other than that, when I'm craving plantains, I'll grab the Publix brand. You guys can see. Push it up a little more. Yep. And this is how I just line them up on the pan. I'll leave that little piece right there for me so I can sample it. Y'all know I got a sample of stuff. All right. Let's move those out the way. Just some little, little pieces right there. All right. Simple, easy. Looks 
like our pressure cooker is starting to get that chicken uh, cooking. It's cooking over there. All right. And I do spray the top of the plantain just a little bit. Help them cook. So, I'm going to go ahead and throw these in the oven, guys. You see how I just threw them on the pan? Simple and easy. And I'll put them in the oven for about 20, 25 minutes. All right, I'll be back. We're going to do the rice next, guys. I'll be right back. All right, it's time to get our Vigo rice together. Um, I put my water in my pot. Um, and I also put the oil, two tablespoons, actually four tablespoons of oil because of the amount of rice that I'm using. So let's go ahead. Let me grab my scissors here. Our water is boiling. That's what we have been waiting for. I'm going to get these bags of rice in our boiling water. I've got four of these little bags. So, and they're five ounces each, so. <clears throat> let's get all of our rice in here. Let's cut our heat down to a medium heat. Now that we've got that water boiling. I love this Vigo rice. I love it. It is my favorite yellow rice. No, it's the Mahatma. I get these two confused. The Mahatma is my favorite yellow rice. But you know what? I like this Vigo too. They taste kind of the same to me. The Mahatma is softer. The Vigo is soft too. You just got to cook it longer. Alright, so I've got all my bags of rice in there. And you see the little chunks of seasons that's in there you got to make sure you get those all stirred up and broken up see those chunks of seasons got to make sure you get that all stirred up I make sure I have that all stirred up and broken up before I cover it up because you don't want a chunk of season just sitting there see and you just stir it that helps it I just stir it until I see all those seasons broken up and then I cover it for 20 minutes. And this is the Vigo yellow rice. I get it mixed up with the Mahatma because they're both in the yellow bags you know. But the Mahatma is my favorite yellow rice. You guys have seen me cook that a million times. The Vigo is good too. I like the Vigo too. Alright, so we've got all our seasons all broken down. Okay, we'll go ahead and cover this. And I will put our timer on for 20 minutes. Alright guys, I will be back. I think the chicken, no the timer says the chicken has 20 minutes. So that's perfect. Our rice has 20 minutes. The um, chicken has 20 minutes. And it looks like the plantains have about three minutes left on the timer so all right guys I will be back uh, when that chicken gets done our rice should be done so the next thing you guys will see is pretty much everything will be done all right guys it's quick it's easy and it's simple all right I'll be back guys okay guys I am back and everything is done let me take you guys into that Vigo yellow rice zoom you guys into that and yes the star of the show has already shown up and left our parsley flakes and I sprinkled a little bit of them in our yellow rice to make our yellow rice more beautiful you take you guys in so you can you can look at all that goodness mm, 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 mm. yep that's our Vigo rice all nice and done in 20 minutes and let's go over here to our plantains I like my plantains a little you know a little extra crispy because you know plantains are soft bananas so um, I like them a little extra crispy on the outside. Take you guys into those plantains. They look so good. Yeah, I taste it when they taste so good. Yes. I love the Publix plantains. They are really good. Really good. 
the girls don't like them. Me and my oldest daughter, we like them, but the girls don't really like them. All right, and let's go over here to our pressure cooker that has already gone off. Take the top off. Hold on, y'all. It is hot. It is smoking. Oh, yeah. Let me zoom y'all down in there. Away from all the smoke. Look at all that goodness. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And see that beef broth that we put in there? You know, it created a curry juice. You know, gives you the little, you sit your chicken on top of your yellow rice and you take some of that curry juice and you pour it over it. I'm telling you guys, it is delicious. Look at that curry chicken. Looks so good. It's going to be juicy, tender, meat going to be falling off the bones. So good, y'all. Look at that. In 30 minutes, 30 minutes, your chicken is cooking, your rice is cooking, your plantains are cooking. Everybody's cooking at the same time. So everybody gets done at the same time. 30 minutes. Everything's done in 30 minutes, guys. Easy. Quick and easy, guys. I like to keep it quick and quick. quick. I like to keep it quick and easy. Zoom y'all in a little bit more. So y'all can get in there with all that goodness. Look at all that goodness. Yes. Yes. Let me take y'all on the other side where the money resides. Let me take y'all over there. Yes. Where the money resides. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all is all down in that Instant Pot. Wait a minute. Y'all get to see all those seasons and juices and let me zoom y'all out. Y'all being too nosy right now. All right. Got y'all down in there. One final look. All right, guys. You seen me do it, so you know I did it. And I'm not arguing with y'all today about that. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.